Hi, today I'd like to introduce you to B Power Tech, a company developing technology that could completely change air conditioning as we know it today. My name is Daniel Betts, president of B Power Tech. Today, a standard air conditioner uses electricity to produce cool, dry air. The operating cost of the system is the cost of the electricity consumed. B Power Tech is developing the B Cool Air Conditioner. This air conditioner uses natural gas instead of electricity. Like a standard air conditioner, it also produces cool, dry air. However, electricity is also produced as a byproduct of the air conditioning process. In the B Cool Air Conditioner, the user pays for natural gas. However, the electricity produced can be used to power the rest of the building. This has an economic value because it reduces the cost of the electricity for the entire building. As you can see, the value of the electricity is in most cases higher than the cost of natural gas. The result is an air conditioner that makes money as it operates. Competitive advantage of the Be Cool product is significant. To illustrate this, a comparison of costs associated with existing high-efficiency rooftop air conditioners, dedicated outside air systems or DOAS, and projected costs for a similar b cool system are shown in the table. This analysis assumes all these units have similar specifications. They provide 2,500 CFM of air to the building and 10 tons of cooling. The b cool system also produces 15 kilowatts of electricity and consumes natural gas at a rate of 43 kilowatts thermal based on its lower heating value. The result shows significant life cycle cost savings ranging from 25 percent to 65 percent depending on how the system is used. Note that the operating cost of the system in New York is a negative number. This is not an error as the system operates it generates electricity at a lower cost than the electricity supplied by the grid. While the electricity price in New York is 15 cents per kilowatt hour, the Beacool system generates it at 8 cents per kilowatt hour, almost half the cost. Increased energy efficiency, together with lower fuel costs due to the use of natural gas, enable the Beacool system to make money while operating. As shown in this slide, in energy terms, natural gas is significantly less expensive than electricity. Moreover, the, the tendency is for this disparity to increase in time. The Beacool system is more than an air conditioner because it provides solutions to some of our most important global problems. Global climate change and a warming planet drive demand for air conditioning it also drives demand for energy efficiency and for products that reduce greenhouse gas emissions, such as the Be Cool air conditioner. Regulations for reduced greenhouse gas emissions and air pollution controls tend to increase electricity prices. Increased prices drive demand for higher efficiency and for products that do not use electricity, such as the Be Cool air conditioner. In places where electricity prices are capped or regulated, the reliability and quality of the electrical service often suffers. This drives people to seek alternative ways of ensuring operation of critical systems. In the commercial sector, air conditioning is a critical system. By using natural gas, the Beacool air conditioner is not dependent on grid stability. Natural gas and LPG are an increasingly important alternative to petroleum and coal due to their lower greenhouse gas emissions. While demand for natural gas and LPG is increasing, their price in energy terms is expected to remain below that of electricity. The World Health Organization considers air pollution the world's largest single environmental health risk. It is estimated that 7 million people die annually due to air pollution. The EPA estimates that this number is 200,000 people in the U.S. alone. The two principal sources of air pollution are the transportation and electricity production industries. The Biku air conditioner does not produce toxic emissions. Since the system generates electricity, it displaces electricity that would have been produced 
using polluting processes and fuels in local power plants. Be Cool provides solutions to all these problems. Let's review the value that we are offering our clients. First, low energy cost for air conditioning. Low energy cost and the capacity to dehumidify efficiently enables the use of outside air, which allows buildings to operate with large number of air changes. This in turn supports air quality within the building. Since the air conditioner is not dependent on the electric grid, it reduces the probability of a complete loss of air conditioning to the building. Since we produce electricity, we increase the reliability of the electric service. Who needs this? Data centers, hospitals, office buildings, shopping centers, to name a few. The air conditioning market is mature, large, and growing. Revenues for the industry in the U.S. were estimated to be $74 billion in 2013 by IBIS World. This represented a 4.1 year-on-year growth. Increasing electricity prices and increased use of central air conditioning systems is driving growth for high-efficiency air conditioners. Navigant Research estimated that the present market is $17.2 billion with an expectation for high growth in the next eight years. The market is projected to be $33.2 billion in 2020. The global market for air conditioning is expected to reach $107 billion by 2016. This represents a 6.1% year-on-year growth in revenues. There is a strong appetite for products that save energy and reduce environmental impact. In fact, the market for energy-efficient products is booming. However, the most successful products are completely transparent to the user. They do not require changes in behavior or infrastructure. The International Energy Agency estimated that in 2011, the energy efficiency market saved $420 billion worth of oil for its member countries. The International Energy Agency calls this the hidden fuel and mentions that the products that produce the highest degree of energy savings are hiding in plain sight. For the consumer, these products are effortless. An example of these products is the LED light bulb. Its success is attributable to three things. It provides users with clear overwhelming benefits over the traditional light bulb. It does not require the user to change his behavior or invest in new infrastructure. Contrast this with a highly innovative and lauded product that failed to gain market traction, the Think Electric Vehicle. This product is demanding. The Think Car is more than double the price of an equivalent vehicle. It is made of plastic, which has environmental benefits, but is strange to the user. This vehicle provided the user with uncertain benefits then. The reduction in gasoline price did not compensate for the vehicle high cost. To use this vehicle, the user needed to get accustomed to decreased travel range and needed to learn to recharge the vehicle whenever possible. This means that a lifestyle change was required. Think went bankrupt in 2011. The Be cool system, like the LED light bulb, is effortless. Be cool provides clear overwhelming benefits over existing products and it is being designed to be a drop-in replacement of existing air conditioning units. This means that no major infrastructure requirements are needed to implement the system and the user does not have to make operational or lifestyle changes to use this product. The system works in the following manner. A liquid desiccant flows between two system components, a dehumidifier and a regenerator. A liquid desiccant is a fluid that readily absorbs water. Hot humid air that we want to cool enters the dehumidifier. Within the dehumidifier, the air comes in contact with the liquid desiccant. In doing so, the moisture in the air is absorbed by the desiccant. This process tends to raise the temperature of the air, so the air is maintained at a constant temperature by flowing a separate airstream through the dehumidifier. This separate airstream cools down the dehumidification process. 
The source of this airstream could be building exhaust air. The temperature of the air is dropped using an indirect evaporative cooler. In this component, water is introduced into the building exhaust airstream. This process drops the temperature of this airstream. We use this low temperature airstream to drop the temperature of the dry air produced in the dehumidifier. The result is cool, low humidity air that can enter a building. The regenerator is an electrochemical device that consumes natural gas and produces heat, water, and electricity. The heat produced by the regenerator is used to recover the water in the liquid desiccant. This water, coupled with the water produced in the regenerator, is used to drive the indirect evaporative cooler. The electricity produced is a byproduct of the regeneration process. The Biku air conditioner system is in the development stage. We have conducted detailed engineering analysis and design, and patents have been filed. We are presently prototyping and testing key components of the system. We expect time to market will take three years. This will include prototyping, testing, design for manufacturing, pilot fabrication, field trial release, and product launch. We deem the technology risk for the product to be low. The vast majority of the system components are off-the-shelf items and have been demonstrated to work under the conditions specified by the BQ system. Our business model is based on licensing, product support, and product development. B Power Tech will work with a manufacturer who pays a license fee to be power tech for the use of its patents and its product design. The company will also derive revenues from product development based on customer requirements. This manufacturer can be an air conditioning OEM or an outsourced manufacturer. The manufacturer will engage suppliers, will provide product warranty, and will supply products in a global market. The manufacturer will work with distributors who will engage customers directly. The leadership of B-Power Tech is conformed by myself and John Kaufman. I have 18 years of experience in the energy efficiency, energy technology, and air conditioning business. This experience has spanned R&D, product development, and corporate management. I have a PhD in mechanical engineering with concentration in thermal sciences. John Kaufman is my co-founder and friend. He brings to the company over 40 years of management experience in corporate management in the energy technology and software field. John was the co-founder of International Batteries and of Iconics. This corporate structure brings together experience and technical expertise and the capacity to reach the company's goals. In summary, our company is developing patented disruptive air conditioning technology. This technology enables us to produce products that provide our customers with overwhelming benefits over existing solutions. The air conditioning market is an existing large market. We expect product release into this market in the next three years. Our management team has experience and technical expertise to achieve our corporate goals. We aim to give people the capacity to control their environment without destroying it. In this way, people can be cool, be green, and be power. Thank you.